Hey, what's up everybody? This is Corey with Corey Hall Fitness. I got a real quick video for y'all this week. I get this message all the time. Everybody wants to know, Corey, what size are your pull-up bars? How big are they? What's the width of them? Uh, and I'm here to tell you that today. I got a bar right here. This is, this is the exact bar that I use. And what it is, it's a one inch bar, okay? It's a one inch galvanized pipe, okay? I buy it 10 foot long, that's what they come in, and I actually get them to cut the bar seven feet long. They'll actually do that for you at Lowe's and Home Depot. If you have other places, I don't know exactly if they do it for sure there, but I know they do do it at Lowe's and Home Depot. They'll cut it for you. you Wanna make sure you get a galvanized pipe, okay? This is very strong. And I know a lot of y'all see my bar bounce in my videos, but that's only because it's, it's seven feet long. When, when something's that long and you're hitting it in the middle, it's gonna have a flex to it, okay? The reason I get this bar and I get this size is because you want a good grip strength around it. That's so important. If you have anything too big, you're not, you don't have that strong grip on. If you have anything too small, it just feels really weird. I find that everybody likes the one inch. I love it and I wouldn't have it any other way because I feel like I, I grab this bar the best, okay? I've grabbed other bars and it's just not as comfortable. Um, the one inch galvanized pipe is the best way to go. It doesn't rust in the rain. It's, it's perfect, it's strong, and it's everything that you need. So this is definitely what you wanna do. Like I said, my bars are seven foot wide. If, if I were to go any further, I'd say the furthest to go would be seven and a half feet. I uh, wouldn't go anywhere past that. But why I like it at seven feet is because you can actually get somebody else on the bar with you. Okay, a lot of times I like to do videos where I got somebody doing typewriter right next to me. Another reason is it's a lot more comfortable doing tricks when you have a wide bar. When you have something that's close and tight, sometimes you're afraid you're gonna hit the side. So if you wanna do a 360 or something like that, it makes it a lot harder. So I would definitely go wide, definitely go seven feet. You'll be most comfortable that way. I promise you won't regret it. And uh, yeah, definitely get the one inch galvanized pipe. Can't go wrong with this one, y'all. Thanks.